Hopefully everyone's having an amazing morning, afternoon, or evening, depending on wherever you're tuning in in the world. My name is EQ and welcome to Alchemy Meta. On the last video, we talked about how to install MetaMask and how to add the Polygon mainnet to your MetaMask wallet. And in preparation for the MetaMystic Superheroes Private Mint on July 7th, in this video, we're going to be talking about how you can add Polygon Matic to your Matic MetaMask wallet. Now, before we get into the video, if you could take a second to throw a like on the video, subscribe to your YouTube channel, and go check out our Discord group, that'd be greatly appreciated. I'm going to leave that link in the description, and make sure to go check out the MetaMystic Superheroes Discord as well. Now, this is the same wallet that we were using when we set up using the Matic mainnet. You can see we have zero Matic at the moment, and we want to add some Matic to this wallet. Just a little test run to make sure that this works. Now there's a few ways that you can go about doing this. The first thing you can do is hit the buy button. Now with the buy button, they're going to give you a few options. These are going to be third-party processors like MoonPay, Transact, Wire, and they'll also give you the option to directly deposit some Matic. Now this is going to be one of the more straightforward ways, and they're going to have you go through a KYC process or a know your customer process. This is pretty common within the crypto community and any sort of crypto transaction, especially if you're going to be dealing with exchanges, more than likely you're going to need to go through some sort of KYC process so they can verify your social security or wherever you're watching this in the world, whatever information to verify you are actually who you are. And the main reason why they do this is to really protect their users. So at the end of the day, it's just protecting your data and making it so the list of people that have access to it is smaller. Now, the other way you can go about this is send yourself Matic from another exchange. So, for example, if you use Coinbase, if you use Binance, KuCoin, CoinX, BitGet, any of the major exchanges on that list, which more than likely a lot of people do have access to one of those types of exchanges, you can always buy Matic because it is available on those exchanges and you can send that Matic to your MetaMask wallet. Now keep in mind, depending on what exchange you're using, some of them do have a delay if you're just trying to add money directly from your bank account. So what I mean by that is if you're using Coinbase, for example, and I deposit $100 right now and I go buy $100 worth of Matic and I try to send it, it's going to make me wait one week to send that Matic in order to verify that I'm not doing any sort of cashback transaction or avoiding that transaction through my credit card company or anything like that. That's just, again, this is another security thing that they do on the back end. And so just keep that in mind if you're just trying to buy and upload money right now from your bank account that you're gonna have to wait a week to actually move it to MetaMask. In some situations on Binance, especially in Binance US, they make you wait 10 days to actually send that money to another exchange. But there are some cases, which is one we're gonna be going over today, which is through BitGet. And that will allow you to buy crypto today. And it'll also allow you to move that money directly into MetaMask today. So you don't have to have any sort of waiting period for that money to be moved. Now, if you want to get access to BitGet, you can hit the link above or hit the link in the description that says Linktree. It's going to take you to something similar to this. And then you're going to click BitGet Exchange. This is our official sponsor. And when you hit those links, you're going to be able to access the sign up link. And you'll see the referral code here. Just make sure and double confirm that this is what you actually see. And when you use that code, you're going to get access to special rewards. Here's just a few of them. And you're also going to get access to up to 15% off your trading fees and transactional fees on BitGet as well. So once you go through this process and sign up, take advantage of those rewards and you get your account created through BitGet. It's going to look something like this. And you're going to be able to see your futures and your assets and everything like that. Now, if you need to buy crypto and you don't have any money and you want to add it directly from your third party, for example, you can go to the buy crypto option, go to third party payment, and this will allow you to add the amount that you want to be buying. You'll want to be buying it into USDT. And in most cases, Simplex or Banksa are the most common to be used. So for example, I can move $200 over and it'll tell you exactly how much is going to be put in, how much USDT I'm beginning. So basically they're going to be taking an $8 fee and then it's going to be taking five to 30 minutes for this transaction to process. Now, once you have some money in USDT, you're going to want to go to spot trading from spot trading. I can type in Matic, click Matic USDT. So then I'm going to want to change this from limit order. This is what you'll be seeing and switch it to a market order. I can use the slider, slide it up a little bit further. Let's say another $7, go through and buy some Polygon. You'll see the order succeeded and now I have a balance of $32 in the test account of Matic. And that's how you would convert from USDT into Matic. So basically you would just buy Matic through USDT. You search it on the bar, click USDT to Matic, and you'll be able to see at the end here that you do have some Matic available. Now the next step is going up to the assets tab. You can go to where it says withdraw. 
And at the withdraw tab, you'll be able to choose what coin you want to send. In this situation, we're going to type in Matic. It's going to ask you what chain you want to send that to. You're going to send that to the Polygon Matic chain. It's going to ask you for your withdrawal address. Now the withdrawal address is going to be accessible through your MetaMask. So you can click the Fox in the top left corner, in the top right corner. And from here, you can copy to clipboard. And this is what the address you're going to want to use. You can add that withdrawal address, put one Matic, for example, because we're doing a test run right now. When you go to submit that order, it's going to ask you to verify some of this information. And when you go through the information and verify all of this, it's going to allow you to send over that Matic. So once you get your email, SMS and funding verification code set up and everything ready to go, you can send Matic from BitGet, press confirm and it'll go through. And once the transaction actually goes through, you should see something like this, give or take in some situations, you might see 0.995 Matic or something like that. But you should be able to see that Matic available now in your MetaMask wallet. Now that you've officially sent some Matic over to this MetaMask wallet, you've officially done your first test send, which is something that you always want to do before sending yourself any sort of money, especially through the crypto blockchains, because if you do send the wrong wallet or send it to the wrong address in the wrong way, you could lose that money forever, potentially. So it's always good to send a little bit of test money before you send the full amount. And once this process is complete, you'll be able to jump back into BitGet and send yourself a larger amount. With our example, you can send the rest of the $200 in Matic, buy that Matic in BitGet, and then move that Matic from BitGet into your MetaMask wallet. And this is going to wrap up our video on how to move Matic into your MetaMask wallet. Make sure to hit the Linktree link in the description. A special thank you to our sponsors, BitGet. Make sure that you're using the right referral code and the right link when you're signing up to make sure that you're able to access these special rewards. You can get up to $4,000 in a first deposit bonus. You can save up to 15% in your trading transactions and transactional fees and so on and so forth just from using this code and signing up with the Alchemy Meta family. If you didn't get a chance to, make sure to throw a like on the video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to drop a comment on this video and I'll make sure to get to you as soon as possible. Hopefully you're all having an amazing morning, afternoon, or evening, depending on wherever you're tuning in in the world, and we'll catch you on the next video.